Now, another CBS 46 exclusive. A Cobb County mom claims a principal is trying to get her to shut up about the problems at her child's school. CBS 46's Brittany Edney first told us about the story last week. She showed us the photos. She's live in Cobb County tonight explaining what happened after we brought the issue to the public's attention. Brittany? Sharon, that parent, she says that the principal here at South Cobb High School approached her Friday afternoon. She has shared with us exclusively the audio conversation of what happened and also says a few moments after that, she was asked to leave campus. Yes. You're not causing a disruption. What was the disruption? About saying how dirty and disgusting our school is. Brando Allison says that is part of her conversation with Principal Clint Terza of South Cobb High School. Allison says she was talking about CBS's 46's story on school conditions where we aired photos of cockroaches, rat droppings, and water damage when Terza approached her. I didn't cause a disturbance. I wasn't loud. I wasn't rude or disrespectful. Here's more of that conversation. You've been here saying it's a disruption, like I'm saying something that was a lie. I mean, it is a lie. It is? Yes. So you don't have There's no rats in our toilets ever. There's ever not. Ever. Would you like to see the video? That is not a. That is it, not a. Would you? That is not, that's not. That's not. That's a few minutes later, Allison says the school resource officer told her she had to leave property. The officer stood there and waited until I got my child. He was very patient. He's a very good gentleman. What was the reason they said you needed to be removed from campus? Because I was causing a disturbance and I, the only thing I was doing is talking to parents. I found a Facebook post the district wrote to a parent which says, quote, most of the pictures referenced above were months old and have been resolved. But just tonight I got this statement from the district. It says, quote, any real facility issues brought to Principal Terza's attention have been resolved quickly and effectively, and the referenced pictures are wildly inaccurate. Now, that statement from this district still doesn't answer my questions about the contradiction where they told that parent on Facebook that that those pictures were quote resolved how it can be both quote resolved and also quote wildly inaccurate at the same time all of the responses that I've got from the school district you can find those on my Facebook page that's facebook.com slash Brittany Yedney news reporting live in Cobb County I'm Brittany Yedney CBS 46 news